really important about this event is it starts to bring us back together in person. And when we uh, collaborate in person, we're just that much more effective. So far, it's been uh, really exciting. Uh, first of all, to uh, see our group come together, albeit in a hybrid way, um, for the first time physically in uh, over three years. So the, uh, the vibe in the room is, uh, is really, really positive and exciting. Classically in machine learning, we were talking about you have training data and you're trying to use it to solve a task. Now you have those fundamental models that they train off on many, many, many data sources and then you build some kind of a structure or a representation that allows you to do the next task easily. In, in my talk, I'm going to talk about something similar in the context of fairness. So I was talking about how natural language processing has made a lot of progress in the last few years, but it still lacks in uh, common sense reasoning, which is required to understand uh, language, which is something that we humans use uh, to understand each other because we don't always explicitly say everything. There are some inferences, some reading between the lines, and there's some ambiguity in language that we can interpret based on our word knowledge and prior experience. So I talked about the privacy risks of federated learning, and in our line of work we found out basically two things. The first thing is that if federated learning is not dedicatedly protected, there is always a very severe risk of privacy leakage for the users. And even if we protect for the federated learning protocol with some dedicated techniques, there is still a risk of privacy leakage because in federated learning, the companies or the servers deploying the protocol have an upper hand in comparison to the users who are relatively powerless in the protocol. The, this afternoon, probably the most exciting element is all of our participants have the opportunity to uh, have a conversation with the researchers behind each poster. Mm -hmm.